Hi, this is Michael from Neatline Antique Maps. And today we're looking at this wonderful copper plate engraved bird's eye view of Istanbul from the late 16th century. So let's dive right in. This map was published in the Great City Atlas that was edited by George Braun and mostly engraved by Franz Hogenberg, which was meant to be a companion to the World Atlas of Ortelius. And I'm kind of joking, but kind of not when I say that this could almost be used as a modern tourist guide to Istanbul. You know, one of the things that makes Istanbul so special is its connection to the past and this tangible sense of history that you get um, when you're walking around the city. And especially for Sultan Ahmet, so much of the city as we know it today is present in this map of the 16th century. The engravers have done a remarkable job capturing the transformations of the city starting of course with the second half of the fourth century when you have this huge population explosion and a real transformation of the monumentality of the city as um, what is formerly Byzantium, the small Greek trading port, becomes Rome's religious and political successor. And here you have the urban elements of that transformation. So you have St. Sophia, uh, you have the Hippodrome, you have these classical elements brought to the east. And of course, you also have um, the Ottoman Empire. Um, and here we see what would become the Topkapi Palace uh, with a note saying this is the seat of the, of the Ottoman rulers. What I also like about Braun and Hogemerg's work are the little details. So here you have the port of the fishermen, the gate of the fishermen by the Galata Bridge, uh, where you get fish today. Or you have on the other side, you have the arsenal down by the area of the Yenikapi excavations where they found this remarkable number of ships that have shown uh, how important Istanbul has been, this city has been to trade uh, for centuries. And last but not least, you have the visual highlight of the map, these vignettes at the bottom of the Ottoman rulers ranging from the 13th century to the end of the 16th century, really the rise and expansion of the Ottoman Empire, arranged on the left side by um, in the pre-conquest of Constantinople in 1453 and on the right side post-conquest. It's not just the artistry of the engraving work here, it's that you have to consider what an impression this would have made on European uh, readers keeping in mind that the 16th century is uh, a time of great confrontation between European powers and the Ottoman Empire. I'm really happy to have shared this wonderful map and see you next time.